Travis, like your time back in Toronto, you were part of uh, some of those teams that were winning series and whatnot. What's your memories yeah. of playing in that city during that era and with those types of players? Well, I mean, it was, it was as a hockey player, Jay, like you'd, you'd understand it. Uh, you know, I think every Canadian kid should get a chance to play in Toronto. Yeah. Uh, it, it really is special. And, and when you win in the playoffs there and win a series, win a game, uh, the city's buzzing uh, from game to game. Uh, it, it was really the most exciting time in, uh, of my NHL career are those moments, those playoff moments that uh, you win, obviously, uh, and losing. It, you know, you feel it. You feel it more when you're in Toronto, that's for sure. And, and uh, I look back at those at those moments and cherish it. It's hard not to as a hockey player. I think it's one thing to win in, <clears throat> in certain cities. Uh, you dream to win the cup. I could only imagine what it would be like to do it in Toronto. From a fan's perspective, uh, I remember watching back in that era. I fucking lived and died with every loss and hit. I mean, that that, that was a war. And I understand the game's yeah. a lot different now, guys. For sure. That was a war. And you lived it, man. Like, what was it like to play for Pat Quinn? Yeah, it was great. Uh, you know, Pat was, when I talk about Pat, I, I it was just his presence. More than anything with Pat, I, I don't think he would proclaim to be an X's and O's guru. Uh, we had a strong veteran team, though, that knew how to play the game. And probably, you know, the X's and O's weren't something that we needed to be taught a lot of, especially back then. It wasn't as detailed of hockey. But he was a presence. And, uh, you know, when he wanted to get a message across, he, he was... He was good at doing it a lot like uh, Al Arbor, I guess, when I had the chance to play with Al Arbor. But, you know, people talk about hockey back then and how, and I remember those series when we played oh. New York, uh, Ottawa, uh, and they were tough and rough and, and dirty. But, you know, you watch playoff hockey and you get down to the ice level and you're in it right now. It's it's tough hockey. And these guys are laying it on the line. Um, you know, it, it's different, but it's not a lot different. It's hard. It's heavy. It's uh, every little inch of the ice matters, and yeah. uh, you've got to fight and grab for it. Uh, and if you don't, the ice can get tilted, and it's just sometimes it's just that extra little little puck battle that decides the difference in a series. To be honest, 